The community ship burns have been great so far, right? These huge contributions that we're seeing right now is really doing a good good thing towards getting the supply down. Is it trillions yet? No. Will it become trillions? Yes. These types of burns grow exponentially, and they will grow exponentially once this big burn event does happening. What I'm talking about is when Shibarium launches. Now, if you guys haven't been paying attention or don't know, Shibarium, Layer 2 Chain, every transaction on it is going to go towards burning SHIB. Some of the bone is likely going to be converted into SHIB and then subsequently burned, actually adding you know pressure to the buying price and burning supplies. So that's actually a very good thing. Now, the question that I keep seeing going around or the number that I keep seeing going around is 99%. Are we going to burn 99% of the supply? And I truly think that this is possible. These burns will increase exponentially over time. And as there's more use case, more utility with Shibarium, that is likely going to increase further. Just think about this, right? We, when Shibarium launches, you already have a community of 1.3 million holders. And you have the opportunity to expand that even further because there are people who maybe didn't get in because they didn't see utility with SHIB. And now with the functionality of a layer two chain, a metaverse, a game, a, a, what's it called? Uh, Shiba net, the, the marketplace, cheese. I couldn't think of the word with the marketplace. There's all these great things that are coming that will just help bolster adoption. And again, every single transaction, every part of this is going to touch Shibarium. Every part of this is going to burn SHIB. This is a fantastic thing. I think a good comparison for what we can look at is if we look at what Terra Classic is doing. Now, if you guys don't, you know, aren't familiar with what Terra Classic is doing, they have their own burn going on right now. They have a large supply as well. It's like six trillion coins right now. And they're working through this same kind of burn. Now, what they've done is they've actually gotten adoption from a lot of a lot of uh, exchanges. You can see Binance on here, MEXC. Uh, there's, there's other ones that are contributing to this as well, but there's also a burn tax that's built into the transactions on chain. Now, Shibarium will obviously do the same sort of thing, but we could get this massive adoption of burn throughout multiple exchanges too. That's where I think some people get lost. They say, oh, you know, it's going to take however many millions of years to their thousands of years to burn this supply. It really isn't okay. It's really not going to take as long as some people think. If Shibarium does see adoption, which it's likely going to, especially as the, the crypto market continues to grow, we hit mass adoption, there's huge adoption from companies and integration into you know government entities, stuff like that. Not saying Shibi is going to be in, integrated into the government, but you guys get what I'm saying, right? As this growth really does take place, that's where we could see this 99% burn. And 99% burn, guys, could mean some absolutely insane prices. You know, people are expecting the global market cap of crypto to be 100 trillion by 2030. And she being right now occupies a pretty significant portion of that already. Now, what the price will be, that's the big question. We'll see, obviously, how this burn takes place. But just wanted to share that with you guys. I think we're on a really good path right now. I like what the, where the market's headed at this time. And I'm excited for the launch of Shibarium, just like you guys. So appreciate you guys as always. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Definitely show your support below. If you haven't, drop some comments. Let me know your thoughts. But uh, appreciate you. Have a wonderful Sunday. And I hope to catch you guys in the next one. Take care.